is going on guys, Smooth Racing here, back with a brand new video, and today we've got F1 live season, round 5 from Spain, our roundup video with Insignia. Hi guys, Insignia GB here, and this is of course the results from the Spanish Grand Prix, which was on the... When was it? <laughs> last, last Thursday. It was on Sometimes. the 8th of May. <laughs> yeah. Right, and the race result was as follows. It was TRL Ellis, who was 15 seconds ahead of Pro Racing 69. I was third, 39 seconds back with my 10 second penalty removed. Uh, IXI Kyle 18, IXI was 1 minute and 9 seconds back in fourth. Super Joshy 9 was a minute Ooh. and 9 seconds back as well in fifth, because he decided to spin at the last corner when he could have had fourth. <laughs> He blocks me. <laughs> <laughs> Random Beats was in sixth, one lap down. Dr. Cedric Toffin was seventh, one lap down. Sluggard Meat was one lap down in eighth. Daniel 2011-54 was ninth, a lap down. And Formula Moss did not finish. Or I don't know why, if that was a disconnect or not. Yeah, he disconnected. I think, yeah. And lucky for him. And then uh, we'll take through the driver standards then after, round, after five rounds of live season. In first, it's Pro Racing with 93 points. Then just behind him, it's Insignia in second with 77. Then it's Cal with 57, Mike with 54, Chris Dix in fifth with 47. Then we get to Tiara Ellis, who's on 25 in sixth. Then it's RBZ, Slugger Meat, Super Joshi 9, Daniel 2011-54, Smiley Faced Hobo, PRL, Jackster, Casey Electronics, Dr. Z, Undescribed, Random Beats, Whooping Spring, and Formula Moss is the last point scorer. I'm kind of so glad he didn't attempt his name. <laughs> yeah. Right, onto the constructors, and Mercedes are still leading the way with 109 points. However, the gap has been closed down by Ferrari, who are now 12 points back on 97. Force India are trailing. How many points back? This is why I failed maths first time around. 19. 31 Oops. points back uh, on 78. William oh, yeah. fourth with 69 points. McLaren are fifth with 59. Red Bull are in 6th for 33, Lotus have 32 points in 7th, and Sauber trail the field with 25 points back in 8th. Yes, it's pretty close, obviously, in the drivers and the teams, and that's what we really aim for. I think it's going to be a really good fight at the top of both uh, constructors and the drivers. And especially, who do you think is going to be uh, emerging out of the teams and the drivers? I think we got a lot of uh, very quick drivers now who've joined. Obviously, TRL Ellis has uh, proved that he's a very quick uh, racer, so that brings it really to a a whole bunch of uh, people who can win races now, probably about five or six, given the conditions. So it's going to be very close as we get into the uh, middle stages of the season when more people join as well. Yeah, we are looking for new drivers after... We've got a few announcements to make, but sadly PRL Jackster has decided to leave. Um, he didn't turn up to round five. And Casey Electronics is on his last warning for missing two races in a row now. And if he does miss another one, we'll have to ask him to leave the league. Yeah, that's mainly because as well he didn't give us any absence warnings. Obviously, if you're in the league and you've got two weeks holiday or whatever, just let us know and we'll be very lenient with it, obviously. But if you're going to not turn up for two weeks and not tell us, then we're obviously going to get suspicious that you don't want to be here or whatever. And we can easily give your place to someone who wants it. Yeah, it was definitely a great race. And I think this week, only one penalty, I think. Which, which was, uh, yeah, no. <laughs> uh, for an illegal take, which wasn't very legal. Which can try to avoid somebody, but... Uh, yeah, I think it was really good racing from everybody. A good win from a Tiara Ellis. Never really looked back after the first um, lap. Yeah, he was very, very quick. Obviously, we had the changing conditions because we went from dries to inters to wets at the very end. And it was very awkward, the chains onto wets, because it meant that everyone was struggling on the last lap for grip, me included. I lost about 37 seconds to Ellis on the final lap because my tyres were dead. Pro Racing lost about, about 10 seconds, I think, as well. So... I think everyone was suffering towards the end. I mean, you uh, nearly grabbed fourth place to give us a free four, but uh, you were just pipped at the end. Yeah, I just about was coming around the final corner. Then uh, Kyle's made a mistake, and then sadly just couldn't quite get past him. Yeah, I nearly destroyed my vehicle crossing the line, so you can tell how uh, difficult the conditions <laughs> were. <laughs> but, yeah, so uh, just round out, talk about a few what happened to all the drivers then. Pro Racing finished second, good race from him. Just have come home, just ahead of Insignia. You got third. Kyle, Mr. Consistent, it seems so far. Getting a fourth position. Mike sadly couldn't turn up. Chris Sticks couldn't turn up either. Um, Ellis, great racing from him. RBZ, sadly couldn't make it either. Um, Slugger Mate had a really poor race. Um, not by his usual standards. I think he finished down ninth. Uh, eighth. 
eighth, as it are. Yeah. Um, yeah, Daniel had a poor race as well. Down in the, he finished ninth, didn't he? Yeah, because he had the penalties yeah. he wanted removing. But obviously, as we discussed, no evidence. Then we can't remove penalties. Uh, Hobo had a fairly. Uh, he didn't actually turn up. He forgot about it. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> Jackstone Electronics didn't turn up. And uh, I'll let you explain the next driver. Yeah, Dr. Z Rick Toffen, as I can say and you can't, had a had his uh, best ever league race by his standards. He uh, had a tough race. I mean, he spun about twice, but still managed to come home in seventh, which was a, a very good result by his standards, and he was very happy with that. Undescribed didn't turn up with no reason, so that's warning number one for him. Random Beats had a decent uh, race. He finished sixth, had a bit of tyre trouble, but he's left already. <laughs> Claiming all, um, no knowledge of him actually ever joining the league, but uh, we'll get into that. And just to mention that, actually, sorry, Underscrab did have a reason he was on holiday, but uh, oh, sorry for not telling you that. Yeah. So and then in Formula, <laughs> yeah, Wolf and Spring, um, we didn't notify him really, so it's not really his fault. And then Formula Moss, hopefully he can finish next race and not disconnect. Yeah, we, once we have all the people back and uh, people actually turn up, we should have a grid of at least 15 people, if not 16. Obviously, the hosting has got better. My connection has actually seemed to have stabilised, as the one, only disconnection was Moss. But uh, it's much better than it was, because, I mean, even in uh, China we only and Bahrain, we only had one disconnection, I believe. So. Yeah, it's pretty good connection at the moment, so that's definitely solid. And like we said, we are looking for new drivers, so if you do want to get involved, just put a comment down in the comment section below, or contact us at InsigniaGB or at Joshua Suttle on Twitter. Yeah, that's the best ways to uh, get in contact with us. We're always looking for new drivers, even if you can't be placed straight into a team. Reserves are usually needed, as everyone obviously won't be able to turn up, so... If you're there online when uh, people can't turn up, you will be invited. We'll obviously notify you if people aren't turning up, but you've got a very strong chance, even if you are a reserve, of being uh, in the race. Yeah, I don't feel that you're not going to get a seat, or you're not going to be racing, because you pretty much are going to be, as a, of course not everyone can turn up every week. Yep, so just to round up then, Monaco is not uh, tomorrow. It depends when you're watching this, but it is on Thursday the 22nd of May which is a week from now if you're watching it on the Thursday. Everyone will be notified the day before. We'll make sure everyone knows about it. But, uh, yeah, just a good race in uh, Spain. And uh, I've been a single GB. And uh, I'll see you next time. And, Josh? Yep. We'll see the drivers and teams championship definitely halting up next week. But uh, we're racing then. See you guys next time. Goodbye.